Good morning, everybody. I'm Jeremy from Nerds on the Go. Got Bob with us from Smokey's Plus. It's been a while since Bob's been to Gatlinburg. My first time meeting Bob was last night. We lost the following meeting in person. And we're at Log Cabin Pancake uh, House, right? Yeah. Yep. Log Cabin. And, yep. So looking forward to this. Heard so many great reviews about it, not just from Bob, but from uh, Smokey Mountain family and lots of the people I talked to. So uh, check out Bob's channel in the description below. And you ready, Bob? Let's go eat. Let's go. Uh, I'm, I'm, I might, you're going to see something historic. I think I'm not going to order pancakes, so that's, oh. that's something something different. But uh, uh, yeah. excited to eat breakfast here, though. It's a great place. House established 1976. It looks just like a log cabin. <laughs> log cabin. It's pretty cool. You got the little covered wagon up there, and then you have the jewelry store here next to it, attached to it. Then over here you have the parking, free parking, antique truck there. But ah, I like that covered wagon and the tin roof cabin. Just it's pretty cool looking. It's about 7:30 in the morning, so usually this place is packed. We've seen lines here. We are told the lines move very fast. That people have eaten here before. Uh, but it's a cold, rainy morning out, so it may have just kept a few people in bed a little bit longer this morning, but we got lots of chairs, rocking chairs, there's plenty of places to sit out here uh, while you wait for your table as well. Throughout Gatlinburg, you see all the little snowmen, and this one I love. It's got the stack of pancakes, the syrup, and it's right here at the front, the log cabin pancake house. Uh, I like that snowman. He is ready to eat. We are at our table now. I've got some fresh hot coffee here and just inside, I mean, it's exactly what you would expect. Just literally a log cabin. Look at that wagon wheel, like chandelier up there. And it's just really well decorated here. It's just, it feels kind of homey. It's, it's nice in here. All right, here's a look at the menu. Here's some breakfast specials right there. I can already see all you can eat biscuits and gravy. Sounds good. They got lots of waffles here. I have a no pancake special. Omelets, side orders. There's a junior plate down there, or senior plate. Here's special treats, pancakes, and French crepes. Wallberry blue cakes sound good. They have a lot of good sounding items here. The prices are very reasonable as well. Spicy apple, French toast. Well. And they got uh, some other options over here sandwiches, hamburgers. Things like that, looks like for, I guess, more towards lunchtime. You look at their beverages here, coffee, you got tea, hot chocolate. And then on the back side here is the kids menu here. So plenty of good options for the little ones. There's also a lunch menu here for the kids as well. So they are well taken care of here. All right, so. We just got coffee and our food here, but look at this guy right here. Who showed well, up? Good morning, everyone. Hey, good Rise and shine. Good morning, Sean. Good, to, good to see you for breakfast. Thank so, you. Yeah, I look at, I could say the same. <laughs> <laughs> and look at this food, everybody. The omelet here looks great. Pancakes. The hash browns look phenomenal. Bob, who didn't get a pancake, his waffle looks amazing. Like this food looks really good. Looking forward to it. And what'd you get, Sean? You got a pancake too, didn't you? Yeah. Our waffle. Yeah, we got a waffle. 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 That's right. Yep. I'm, waffle. I'm getting caffeined up right now. <laughs> Just got the fresh hot syrup loaded up on there. The syrup here bottle is super hot to the touch. That's really nice to have that. And look at this omelet right here. I'll open it up for you real quick, but it's fully loaded up in there. This this is a good full breakfast right here. All right, so I'm digging in now, and like these pancakes, even though I don't like pancakes much, are fantastic. I got some fresh salsa here from my omelet. Makes it over the top good. It's really good. It looks like a big mess right there. I know, but it's so good. Hash brown's fantastic. Bob somehow has destroyed this waffle, so it must have been good. Like I'm still working on my food. Sean's just getting I started. Haven't even started yet. <laughs> I'm too busy. Yappity yappity yappity. Bob, is it as good as you thought it would be? Oh, of course it is. I mean everything. On the level of the pancakes, though, what do you think? Oh well, you know my pancakes. 
can't go. <laughs> yeah. Like, as far as quality goes, like, this is top notch. That's awesome. I'm going to get back to it here, but I'm telling you, this omelet, these pancakes, these hash browns are top notch. And I'm not a huge fan of pancakes, so that's a lot, saying a lot for these pancakes here. All right, so obviously I ordered too much food here. I got this hash brown just in case I didn't like the pancakes. Does anybody else eat the center of their pancakes out? This guy right here it makes fun of me for burrowing out my pancakes Look right here. It. So the whole an animal. It's, 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 the center is the best part. Let's see, how was your waffle? Well, I didn't like it. <laughs> I, I want to talk to the manager. <laughs> Gone in I two did seconds. Not like it. Gone in two seconds. We already know what Bob thought. <laughs> Bob cleaned off his plate and everything, but. Let me know. Do you burrow out your pancakes no, or do you eat it no like this that. guy right here? No one should be doing that. If you do that, then both you and Jeremy need some help. <laughs> <laughs> so unfortunately, you have a buffet here, but COVID has cut that out. So now it's just a stuffed animal bar. Get you a couple stuffed animals here. It's actually pretty cool. So they got some little uh, magnets over here you can purchase. Uh, they have some taffy and some different things over here. So. It's a really cool restaurant. It's starting to get a little busy now, but really awesome. There's where you pay at right there on the left is where you come in. But just a really cool place there. All right, so there we have it. That was the Log Cabin Pancake House. Uh, Bob, what'd you think? Oh, I mean, I, I've come to this place for years. Like the first time we ever came to this place was like a, a nine or ten years ago. Uh, this is one of the first places we ate. So absolutely love it. Definitely one of my favorites. Um, Got, didn't get a pancake, got a waffle, and it was delicious as well. But like this, the serving staff, everything, it, it's just top notch here. Awesome, Sean. What do you think? I had an amazing waffle, great service, black coffee, and I'm full. <laughs> yeah, for me, I had the uh, Western omelet, had the bacon and sausage and peppers, onions inside. Fantastic, loved it. it was like over salty or anything. Sometimes omelets get a little bit salty. Had the fresh salsa that I asked for on top. Again, fantastic. Uh, I did order the hash browns because I'm not a pancake person, uh, so I told Bob I'll try pancakes here. So that's why I ordered the hash browns, just in case, but I ordered too much food. Uh, hash browns were fantastic too. And I will tell you, even though I don't like pancakes, I would get them here again. Uh, the pancakes here have, to me, like a little bit of vanilla in it, uh, not overly sweet. The syrup I like, sometimes you get syrup that's really sweet and I hate that. Here it's more kind of like a compliment to the pancake. So it's really good. The fresh whipped butter on top. Oh man, those pancakes were good. Uh, and then Bob gave me a piece of his bacon. That's some of the best bacon in the Smokies right there. I'm telling you right now, that's, that's some good bacon. Than bacon. <laughs> oh yeah. So for me, <laughs> on the nerd scale, I'm giving it 10 out of 10. Like I'll come here again, I'll get pancakes again, omelet, and you know, the service here was fantastic. Our server was really good. You know, get even here early too. Get here early. Yeah, they open at seven, and even Sean was running a little bit late. I'm just telling you this to so you know how good the service was. So we already had got him a coffee waiting for him. Yeah. The server came and said, "I'll put the coffee in the back and bring him out a fresh one." Didn't have to do that. that was nice. Everybody would have been so happy they didn't do that. Uh, so just fantastic service. Highly recommend it. If you're in the area, give it a try. It's got Bob's approval. It's got Sean's approval. Now it's got the nerds' approval. With that being said, the nerds are out. <laughs>